Guys, welcome back sa aking math channel at dito ay detalyado kong tatalakayin kung paano nga ba i-compute ang mean o ba discrete probability distributions. Muli, ano nga ba ang mean? This is the most common measure of central tendency or location. This value is used to represent the entire set of data. At ang ating formula na gagamitin para ito ay masolve ay mu equals the summation of x times the probability of x. At sa pag-solve nga natin ng mean of the probability distribution, step 1 is construct the probability distribution for the random variable. Number 2, multiply the value of the random variable by its corresponding probability. Number 3, add the result obtained in step 2. And number 4, interpret the mean of the discrete random variable. Simulan na natin, consider rolling a die, find the average random variable x representing the number of spots that would appear. Para mas detalyado at madaling intindihin, isolve natin siya in table form. First column natin is the number of spots, second column is the probability, and third column is the product of the number of spots and its probability. At para sa ating step 1, construct the probability distribution for the random variable x representing the number of spots that would appear. Ang number of spots lang naman na pwede natin mangyari sa rolling a die is posibleng 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, at 6. Since a die has 6 spaces and all the spots should appear once, therefore the probability of all the number of spots should be 1, 6. At para sa ating step 2, multiply the number of spots to its probability. 1 times 1, 6 equals 1, 6. 2 by 1, 6 is 2, 6. 3 by 1, 6 is 3, 6. 4 by 1, 6 is 4, 6. 5 by 1, 6 is 5, 6. And 6 times 1, 6 is 6 over 6. For step 3, we will add the results in step 2. So add natin yung third column. Since na 6 lang naman ang kanilang denominator, copy lang natin ang denominator na 6, then i-add natin ang kanyang numerators na 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 equals 21 over 6. Pag dinivide ang 21 by 6, ang result is 3.5. After adding the third column, we are now on the fourth step. Interpret the mean of the discrete random variable. Therefore, the mean of the probability distribution is... 3.5. It means that the average of the random variable x representing the number of spots would appear is 3.5. Proceed tayo sa ating problem number 2. The probabilities of 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 COVID-19 patients on any day in a hospital are 0 0.18, 0 0.25, 0 0.12, 0 0.30, and 0 0.15 respectively. Find the average number of COVID-19 patients every day. Proceed na tayo sa ating step 1. Kawin na natin ang kanyang probability distribution. Column 1, number of patients. And column 2, its corresponding probabilities. I-multiply na natin yung number of patients sa kanyang corresponding probability. 2 times 0.18 is 0.36. 4 times 0.25 is 1.00. 5 times 0.12 is 0.60. 8 times 0.30 is 2.40. 10 times 0.15 is 1.50. Next, i-add na natin yung ating results sa step 2. Therefore, the summation of x times p of x equals 5.86. Then, interpret na natin ang result. Therefore, the mean of the probability distribution is 5.86. It means that the average of the random variable x representing the number of COVID-19 patients every day is 6. Rounded off for it is a human kasi wala namang uh, fractional part na patient. Third and last problem tayo for this video. The traffic violators apprehended in a certain town on random days of the month are 10, 12, 18, 25, 34, or 44. Its probabilities are 0 0.15, 0 0.25, 0 0.36, 0 0.18, 0 0.04, and 0 0.02 respectively. Find the average number of violators apprehended in any day of the month. Gawin na natin kaagad ang kanyang probability distribution at i-multiply na rin natin ang column 1 and column 2. 10 times 0.15 is 1.50, 12 times 0.25 is 3.00, 18 times 0.36 is 6.48, 25 by 0.18 is 4.50, 34 times 
uh, 0 0.04 is 1.36, 44 by 0, 0.02 is 0 0.88. Then, i-add na kaagad natin ang ating result. The summation of x times the probability of x equals 17.72. Therefore, the mean of the probability distribution is 17.72. It means that the average of the random variable x representing the number of traffic violators apprehended in any day of the month is 18. And that's all guys. Again, madali lang isolve ang mean of the probability distribution in table form following the steps. Again, don't forget to subscribe.